hi guys yeah in this video i'm going to show you how to make a braided wig from start to finish from ventilating how to achieve a spoiler course without having to use any stuff at all so stay tuned and keep watching all right so this is how i ventilate already i've done the ventilation but this is how it looks like and this is in between ventilation you can use any measurements of your choice i mean the next you can use any measurement i'm using five by five closure for this tutorial and i'm going to pin it down on the cap that i'm going to use for the wig making so after that i'm going to be sewing the closure around i'm going to be sewing the closure to the wig cap Yeah, I'm going to cut out the wig cap that covered the neck. I just want the cap to be so clear why I'm making the wig. So in this part, it requires I section the hair from a corner like i don't do the sectioning from the middle this is the style that i'm going to be making so it's very optional you can just part as the spirit leads i'm going to leave a link in the description box on how to make blended with ventilation to look like this in case you want to learn it then go click the link to learn how to do it now after the pattern i'm going to start braiding and in this part i didn't do the treatment i just started braiding without doing the treatment Now this part is for those who want to learn how to make a braided wig like first timer or beginners. So next thing I did was to use my crochet pin and attachment. Big attachment with the crochet hook like I'm doing spacing it. I don't want it to be crusted. So after that I use attachment and start braiding. And I'm going to tie it and leave like I'm not going to finish the attachment because we want to call the remaining part so you braid and stop anywhere you want to call they tell me that i'm never gonna make it they want me to do something that can make sense they hate when i keep dreaming i'll be famous but i don't give a fuck i'm gonna keep chasing I got all this potential that's deep inside of me But they hate when you're successful cause they try to be They sit there being just meant to because you're trying things And they just want you to settle and do the right thing So get a good job, don't slack off Wake up every morning, make a good impression For the cutting of hair, I'm going to take the amount of braided hair that I want to cut Then tie it with a rope I'm using a thread to tie I'm I'm not tightening it tight so once you have secured the first end then start tying it gradually like I'm doing without tightening it 
because the part that I'm cutting is very long so as I tie I drag it up as I tie I drag it up to give me that cut that I want so if the part that you are cutting is not long like mine you can just tie once and drag it just to create a coil like this so this is it and I'm going to do the remaining ones now I'm going to pour water on the whole hair and including the place that I've tied so this is it this is how it looks like when I've poured hot water on it next is to use my scissors to lose out the thread that I tied When creating a coils, I'm going to tell you this, if you want your coils to be a kind of stretchy and long, then you can grab braided hairs, mush together and tie to create a coil, then after that you detangle and make it look stretchy. Or if you want to create that kind of coils that is just there, that is not stretchy but a very tight coil, then you can tie just one hair or two hairs, two braided hairs to get a tight coil or a very nice it depends on what you want to achieve look at how my looks like look at how my coils looks like i hope you found this video helpful if you found this video helpful give me a thumbs up and leave a comment on what you think about the hair and don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you are here to do so thank you for staying to this moment see you in my next video